Tavares scoring his third goal of the series and Thomas Grice finishing with 27 saves. The Islanders and Panthers are now tied at two apiece in the series after a late third period goal by Florida. The Panthers now earn their first playoff road win since 2012 as the Islanders know yet another slow star contributed to their woes. We just didn't have a great start and uh, we just didn't make it hard enough on them tonight and saying that we, we had a great opportunity to get the result we wanted and we didn't so we're going to have to go down there and uh, you know get a, get a win and then uh, you know want to come back obviously up in the series so as disappointing it is uh, you got to put it behind you and we got to get ready for uh, for Friday. Well you're not going to win many games when you score one goal and the same guys score. We gave up 22 shots, even strength. I thought structurally we were pretty good, but we didn't create much. We got one line, 91, 51, and 21, creating all our offense right now. And we got to find a way um, like we did in Florida when we had secondary scoring and then the other night here when we had secondary scoring. If not, it's going to be tough. It stings. Uh, it, it's one you want to win. It uh, puts you in a pretty good situation going back to their building. But um, it's over now. It's a 2-2 series, and um, we regroup and get ready for a big one in Florida. But... Um, opportunity definitely slipped away tonight. Keep in mind that the Islanders are still trying to win their first playoff series since 1993, and on Friday they will try to get closer to that goal one more time as the series shifts back to Florida. In Brooklyn, Michelle Yu, SNY.